can we know the way? And how can we live in faith? So, okay, so when we start, we've, we've got our master schedule ready to go. There's 43 children ready to make, and they get to select whatever date they choose. Of course, we know that. And then we have dinners for our rehearsal night. So again, we're gathering in community with our parents and the children. Um, and we have very intimate moments in our liturgy as well, not just um, dinner, but we also ask them to set the table for the liturgy of the Eucharist, the second half of Mass. Um, they get to bring their own family tablecloth and set the table together as a family. Um, it's one of my favorite parts. It's actually a very intimate moment for Mass for the families in particular. Um, and then the special day when they get to come up and make the sacrament. And as they come up, they're guided on each side by mom or dad. And anybody who's with them that day, if they'd like to. I actually like the fact that our parents are involved and, and it's not just a drop drop off program like I said the parents are actually um, they're interested in the faith they want to be a part of that faith growth that the children get and in turn they grow as well so the program that's my favorite part that the parents are actually a part of it but what I what I think how we're different is um, learning through faith in action and real life experiences which truly gives you authority on faith can we know the way and how can we live in faith I think it means that like I'm becoming more of like I become a bigger member of the church I'm going to be a grown up I get to be closer to God then I get to eat the host and drink the wine I feel happy about me being a part of Jesus again Instead of making my reconciliation, I can make my community and be a bigger part of Jesus. You get to like be connected with God more and with the church. You can read Jesus. Mm -hmm. That I'm actually a part of the church. That means I'm going to get closer to God. For the first time, I'm going to take the bread and drink some wine and then walk around the church. Have the bread and drink the wine. It's where you learn about God and you're getting ready to eat the bread and drink wine. It means like God in my heart. Um, I mean God in my heart. It means we accept the body of Christ and we like accept his blood means that I'll be able to taste the bread at church and do what my parents do at church. Receiving the Holy Spirit. It, it means a lot about Jesus and you you'll get your you'll get your permission to have the bread in the church and all that and it's a very special special day or It's exciting because like all, all my grandpas and grand, grandmas and my mom and dad are coming and watching me get my first communion. Uh, putting on a big dress and then um, they're going to have like a little party. And after we're, we're going to have a little party with my family. My mom said the family is going to be out down here so they're going to come to my communion and uh, we're probably going to celebrate. We have a little party. We're going to have a party. I don't know what kind of. Who's coming? Um, some, some relatives from Texas. We're going to have our family over. She's going to invite about 50 people. <laughs> have a party afterwards. Party! My godmother's coming, and we're gonna get our hair done before the communion. So, um, I have a family over. After we go to church, I'm gonna have a party with my family. How can we know the way? And how can we live in?
Um, I traced some different color Sharpie markers on it, like red, silver, and black on it. Oh, and then some of the designs I traced, like I traced the, um, the cross on it, and then I um, wrote, I, I, I drew, drew a picture of the wine glass and put First Communion on it. I just drew on it with a little bit of marker, and when we went home from the daddy daughter dance, I put my corsage around it. I put um, my picture when I was in soccer on it, and I'm like caring and loving and helpful. Uh, with my favorite things, I had jewels on it and some stickers. And my name on it in black marker. I decorated it with stones and I put my name up and down. I put my name on it like butterflies and flowers. I think I tried to put ice skates on it. I put all the colors in it, I think. Besides like some other colors, like the dark ones in black. I, um, put my name on the side and then I put like some st stuff that I do like camping, um, I put family, sports, stuff like that on it. Like traced the cross on there and added a few like like church words I guess you could say like faith and hope and stuff like that so. Polka dots on it. <laughs> stickers about baking on it because I love to bake and a couple owl stickers because my teacher likes owls. I decorated it with my name in Sharpie and I made a rainbow on it and I made a cross too and that's it. They're all over me and my cousin but then we, I didn't, make, my parents didn't really like it so we went to the store and we erased everything and then we bought jewels and sparkly glitter and we decorated like that. I took little sports stickers and I made my name off them and I filled in the cross with them. Then with, when I put the name on them, I took um, like this sparkly glue, so all types of stuff and I like crossed my name outline my name with the glue. Um, my name, and a cross, and hearts. Oh yeah, hearts, and peace signs, and that's about it. <laughs> and decorations. And decorations. <laughs> Crosses and peace signs. Yeah, I put my name on it. Um, I have these little lime green squares, and I put a cross on it with those little tiny lime green squares. I wrote communion on the bottom of it, then I wrote my name down, and then I wrote like hope and God on it. They're blue and they have decorations with uh, a cross and people on it. And, and I drew a cross and um, there were people on it. And, and I wrote my name on a candle. It has like all hearts on it that stands for love of God and Jesus. Dolphins, I love God, friends, family, family, mm -hmm. and stickers. I put my name on it and I put a cross on it. That's it. A cross that looks like it has a cross and then my name on it. 
it looks like it has a cross made with all these little glass beads and then my name made with shells.